Hello. Today I would like to share a little knowledge. That is about comparing RGB color of two images. This step actually just count a dominant color of image in RGB value. Then we compare the value to other RGB. Let's take a look at this example, we have two images here. Let's say image 1 and image 2. First, we have to choose both image to input file. OK, the compare button will subtract image 1 to image 2. And here is the result. The image 1 produce this RGB. And the image 2 produce this RGB value. And if image 1 subtract image 2, so the difference is, this value. This just a quick example of how to compare RGB value of two images. And here is the source code, just like any HTML file. And this is folder structure. This is our main file to perform everything. And in assets folder, we've got CSS bootstrap. And in the JS folder we've got bootstrap and jQuery.js. This is our main library to compare a dominant color. I've forked his library and add some codes to adapt with our condition. This is the main functions. And if you curious about this example, you can fork, clone and contribute to my GitHub repository. You can see the URL address. And now, let's take a look at our main index file. This is our CSS link. And this for header text. And this code for image 1. And this code for image 2. And this button for firing the compare function. And this div for our information. And this is our JS files. And take a look at our functions. This for handle input image 1. This for handle input image 2. And this for add event listener, every time the input file change, it's gonna fire. And let's begin our compare function. First we define all variables. And get the HTML image tag. This is forget the dominant color of image 1. This forget get RGB value image 1. This is forget the dominant color of image 2. This forget get RGB value image 2. And now we can subtract both value. And then finally we assign result to information div.
And let's try again, just make sure everything works correctly. We get the same result. It's really simple, you can try by yourself easily. I think enough for today, I hope you can understand it well, don't forget to subscribe, comment or like this video, and wait another video tutorial. Have a nice day.